Hello guys, Tricks Audi here today, and I'm going to show you how to install Forge on a Mac 1.8 plus too many items mod. So basically, let's just get started. So here we go. First, click your Minecraft launcher. It's the first thing you got to do. And I guess you just want to pick the version that you want to run. So I guess basically for Forge we're going to install, I choose 1.8. But whatever you want to install for Forge, you click what you want to do, like 6.4, 1.7.10. Okay, so basically you want to save profile and click play. You just want to click play. And then make sure it loads to the loading screen, then you can't slide of that. Okay, now after you've done that and you load the loading screen with the version you want to use, you go to versions and you'll see that you made a file, 1.8. Then, that's as good. You want to go to Forge, which is in the description, files.minecraftforge.net. Then go to the version you just ran or what you're trying to install. So go to 1.8, and then click 1.8, and then you want to download the recommended. The latest could have bugs, but only if it's really new. So download installer if you're using a Mac. Then you'll be sent to an ad website. Don't click anything on the website unless you're going to click the skip download, skip ad. You skip the ad, because if you don't want to do anything bad, like, you know, download a virus. So skip the ad, and you have it. You cancel out of that. Then you're going to do command click, no, control click. And then you're going to click jar launcher default or just open. And it's going to say, Do you want to open it? You're going to click open. Okay. And then click install silent. And this should be your Minecraft directory down here. So install silent and go here. And you'll see that you installed it. Now go back to your Minecraft. Once it opens up, you're going to click to the edit profile thing right down here. And you're going to choose Minecraft Forge 1.8. Click that. Click play. Load it to the loading screen. Then go back. I have mods in my folder, so I'll remove them. So basically, what you want to do is that you want to put the mod, Too Many Items mod, which I'll show you how to get. The link is in the description. You go click the link. Then you download the Forge mod, because we're using Forge. And you again, you skip the ad, and it'll download. So skip add over here. Okay, so since you'll install it, you want to put it in your mods folder. Then you go back down here into your Minecraft. And then you want to make sure that you're using Forge, which is the one you just installed, and you just loaded the screen, and put the mod in, and you want to click play. When you're editing the files, you want your Minecraft launcher to always be closed when you're editing files, or you might ruin something. So basically when it loads, it's going to have a loading screen, and the Forge stuff is going to do its thing. And then we're just going to see if the mod installed, and if it's all installed correctly, then this tutorial is pretty good. Okay, so it's doing its thing right now. I'll just have to wait for a moment. I know, nobody likes waiting. Okay, so you want to go to single player and just click any new world. Just put... New world, and whatever world you want to play, this mod shouldn't damage your world. It's a very nice mod. Too many items is a good mod. So, basically, you want to just go to your world, and then it should load the thing up, and when you click inventory, it should be there. So, building world. Okay, building terrain, and here we go. So, so I go into my inventory here, you'll see the mod was successfully installed. To me, mod, custom enchants, stuff like that. You know, all this cool stuff like, you know, knockback. You can't go over when you're enchanting to 127. Anything higher, that won't work. Basically, the main point of the mod is just to do this. And knock pigs out of the sky with your little enchantment stuff. So, well, I hope you guys liked the video and enjoy. Subscribe and like, comment, and maybe give an idea for the next video, and that'll be in the next video. Well, have a nice one, guys, and see you in the next video. Bye.